hello guys thank you all for having me once again so today's video is going to be a short motivation for you and for me all right um i get this question lately people ask me are you a designer or what <laughs> no i am not a designer i'm me i'm not a designer as in no <laughs> but the name the designers original is not just a name but it is who i am it is me Yeah. The meaning of the designer's original is my father, God Almighty, is the master designer. He designed the heavens and the earth and everything inside it. So I am his original copy. I am the original copy of me. There is no other me out there uh if you like you can check around you can only get people that are looking like me but there is nobody exactly like me even if you get somebody exactly like me you can never and ever get anybody who has the same fingerprints like more <laughs> so that makes me unique that makes me different. That makes me an original version. So you are also the designer's original. You are also the king's kid. So from today, I want you to see yourself as that and carry yourself as the designer's original. That doesn't mean you are perfect that only means you are an imperfect person in the perfection of your father so what people think about you does not make you less of who god says you are people's recommendations people's validations doesn't change who you are you are you the designer's original the king's kid, the favored one, the beloved one, you are loved. You are fearfully and wonderfully made after the image and the likeness of God Almighty. Have you imagined, have you ever thought of imagining yourself as um, the child of the most worthiest person on the earth? Just take a second and imagine yourself to be like, the child of one of those worthiest people on earth. How does that feel? <laughs> it feels so good. But you are much more. You are the child of the one who owns the most worthiest person on earth. So that should make you higher, higher, higher. <laughs> okay, so that's who you are. You are the designer's original, the king's kid. Simple. Whether somebody like it or not, you are you. Whether people accept you or not, you are you. <laughs> Whether people love you or not, you are you and you are loved by your father okay it does not matter what you have or what you do not have where you are geographically does not change anything the money in your bank account does not change it your degrees and certificates the ones you have and the ones you do not have does not change it and your brown skin does not change anything because you are who god says you are you are unique. 
you are beautiful. Thank God for those who love and like you and appreciate him for those who do not. It doesn't make any change. Just love you and make you happy because even if the whole world is against you, he is for you. And he has said in his word that he will never leave us nor forsake us. Whatever you think that you don't have, that you think that make you less human. I want you to just concentrate on what you have, not what you don't have, okay? Just happy yourself for what you have. And it's just a matter of time. And what you don't have is coming. Whatever that we're praying for that we do not have yet should not make us see ourselves any less because when you're praying for something and you've not gotten it yet, it can be two things. It's either it's not time yet or you are not ready for it yet. Okay, so let's not see every unanswered prayers as evil or as a curse. No. It can be that God is preparing you for something bigger than what you're asking for or you're not ready yet for that thing you're asking for now. So that is it. I am the designer's original. I am me. I am unique. I am beautiful. And I am wonderfully and fearfully made. I'm rich because my heavenly father is rich. Thank you all for being here with me once again. The Lord bless you and may he cause his face to shine upon you once again. Thank you.